beautiful, isn't it? And yet you probably believe that aerosol sprays are full of a dangerous chemical that does a bit of this and a smidgen of that and a whole lot of something else to our environment, right? My friend, you couldn't be more wrong. Hello, I'm Neil White of the Fluorocarbon Council. <laughs> now, in the past few years, the fluorocarbon good name has been tainted with accusations and propaganda that don't give you the whole story. For example, did you know that in French, the word fleur means flowers? I didn't think you knew that. <laughs> and I like flowers, and so does my wife. I bet you didn't know that either. But enough about me, because I am here to dispel rumors and restore respectability to that mighty king of chemicals, the fluorocarbon. How do you respond to environmentalists who claim you aren't giving us the facts about the dangers of fluorocarbons? Oh, you mean those long-haired liberal can't keep a job, drain on the taxpayer, ACDC acid head so strung out on drugs they don't know what the hell they're talking about, environmentalists? I respond by saying, let's not get personal, let's stick to the facts. What are the facts about fluorocarbons? Hmm? What are the facts about fluorocarbons? Oh, that's a, uh, a straightforward question, and I like that. And I'm not going to dance around and mince my words. I'm not going to toss off a bunch of double talk and triplicate. I'm not going to say one thing and then turn on a dime and say something totally different. And I'm not going to talk out of both sides of my mouth. And you know why? Because that would only confuse the issue and cloud the truth. And then, my friend, nobody wins. Next question. Are you full of crap? Nope. I'm concerned about the greenhouse effect. Isn't that caused by fluorocarbons? Well, yes, but have you ever been in a greenhouse? Because if you have, you probably noticed some pretty big, strong, healthy plants in there. And that's exactly what the greenhouse effect will do for you. Make you big and strong and healthy. Just like Ken Griffey Jr. Since fluorocarbons are proven to destroy the ozone layer, aren't they bad? See, what most people don't understand is that the ozone we have is really old and really gunky, and we need new stuff. But in order for new ozone to grow, we have to get rid of the old ozone. It's kind of like cleaning your plate in order to have seconds. So the sooner we join the Ozone Clean Plate Club, the sooner we're going to get seconds on ozone. Well, we are just about out of time, so if you'd like more information, send $10 for your free, wonderful World of Fluorocarbons pamphlet. And for just $90 more, also receive a complimentary copy of my newest book, Neil White's Favorite Fluorocarbon Recipes. Delivery will take four to six weeks or longer. Good night.